It is time to update the way you take progressive lens measurements with the DigiFit smartphone application. DigiFit enables you to take simple and precise measurements for monocular PDs and fitting heights. The previously used ruler method of taking measurements required time to confidently measure, had inherent inaccuracies and required close contact with the customer. Using DigiFit to take measurements will minimise customer contact and allow you to do most of the measurement while maximising social distancing. And this is a particularly important safety procedure during COVID-19 restrictions and a practical health and safety measure. The in-app tuition and clear interface ensure you are guided through the process and taking measurements shortly after downloading the application and logging in. A useful feature of the DigiFit app is that it can provide you with gentle reminders to assist in the reliability of the results. For example, it will not allow you to take photographs if you are not in an ideal position. In addition, once finalised, the app will notify you if your results are outside the expected values, prompting you to double check if needed. A ruler can never do this. The first step is to download the app and log in using your unique username and password. Once your smartphone is ready, make sure you sanitise the DigiFit clip in front of the customer. Now adjust the customer's frame so they sit comfortably on the customer's face. If your customer's posture is looking a little unnatural or stiff, prompt them to relax and mount the DigiFit clip over the frame, ensuring it is approximately centred. If a customer is wearing a mask, activate the mask mode on the DigiFit app before proceeding with the measurements. A prompt will appear to ensure the customer's glasses are not resting on the mask. Now you're ready to take the measurements. For good facial recognition, maximise the light on the customer's face. Unlike other digital devices, multiple lighting sources within the retail area will not create any concerns with the application, and in fact, the more light the better. A good idea is to have the customer face a window to maximise the lighting and ask the customer to gently widen their eyes when you're ready to take the photo. This will help you identify the iris. The first step to taking the measurement is finding the right distance from the customer. Ask the customer to stand comfortably in a natural body and head position as if they were looking into the far distance. This is no different to using any other method. Now, ask the customer to keep still while you hold your smartphone upright and bring it up to their eye line. Once in position, ask the customer to look at the camera on the phone. Note that centering the camera may be different to centering your phone, and this may feel a little strange at first as most cameras are on the side of the phone. Position the phone 40 to 45 centimeters from the customer and ensure the dotted lines fall within the highlighted box. The dotted lines should appear green when the distance is successfully achieved. It will appear orange if you're too far or too close to the customer. Adjust your smartphone distance accordingly. The green cross should be approximately aligned with the nose and the horizontal bar aligned with the customer's eyes. This is to ensure the customer is looking straight ahead during the measurement. A PD ruler could never do this. Once you have the right distance, it is time to get the correct angle. See that orange circle? Position your smartphone upright or vertical and ensure the circle falls within the ring. The circle should appear green when the angle is successfully achieved. The circle will appear orange if it falls outside the ring and it simply means that your smartphone is not vertical and you need to adjust it. When both the distance and angle are aligned, the bar and marker should turn green. Hold still, press the button to capture the image. There is also an option to turn on the auto mode, which will automatically capture the image once the bar and marker turn green. Practice to find out which method you prefer to use. Once the photo is captured, the app will present the frame boxing and iris alignment page. Boxing the frame is particularly important as it ensures correct monocular PDs and height measurements. Tap the pointer to adjust lines to box the frame. Make sure the box is aligned to the widest edges of the front rim of the frame. For fine measurements, tap the arrow keys. Once you've finished boxing, align the green circle so it's centered over the iris. Now you don't need to center it on the pupil or any corneal reflections and utilize the micro adjustments to confirm the position. Now that the measurements have been taken, you can input additional information. This includes the customer's name and reference number. 
The customer's type of frame is really important because it will calculate the heights depending on the frame type. Now your measurements are complete and you can share the files by email or have them printed. We hope you are excited about this new, simple and precise way to complete measurements for PDs and fitting heights. It will be an easy way to train your whole team with the DigiFit smartphone application and get them to recommend and measure PALs in no time.